Welcome again uh, in tutorial about control points and editing. In this tutorial you'll learn how to rebuild CARP to have more control points. So, uh, okay, let's switch the control points on. So now you've got a <coughs> only four po control points. We need uh, a little bit more for some purpose. Mm, so how to do it? If you want to rebuild the control point, you have to find the tutorial with uh, look, uh, which looks like this, and then switch, uh, turn it on, select the curve, and then <coughs> the small window appear, and you have a uh, something you have to. Uh, choose and something you have to add. Uh, for example, point count. It means that if you add points here, so then your curve will be splitted on more amount of pi pound pound points. Uh, degrees, uh, kind of tension of the points and uh, between each knot. So basically, you not we're not interested about degree um, at this level. So let's just keep focus on point count. So for example, let's let's do nine. And uh, as you can see, we've got more control points. Uh, of course, you can uh, you can decrease the amount of pound points the same way. You're selecting rebuild and then changing con uh, amount of control points down. But you have to remember it won't be the same curve as the begin at the beginning. So if you want to see, I will just make a control Z. You see? The control Y. This is very important. You have to be careful. Because uh, decreasing the amount of points might destroy your original shape, uh, and uh, it might have huge impact on all design you've made. Um, there is another way you can add control points by uh, the way by the place you want it. So go to the Mm, control points on off and then uh, there is something called insert not and you can just insert whatever you like for example here and here and you've got more control points in the place uh, where you select uh, and also we can remove knots like I don't want that one I don't want that one, I don't want that one. This is it. This is easy as this. Okay, thank you very much for watching.